we're really excited to be embarking on this partnership with the Tej Kohli Foundation in curing corneal blindness around the world. And our vision for that is to attack corneal blindness from a number of different directions. One of the areas that is going to be funded by the Tej Kohli Cornea Program at Mass Eye and Ear is the Nanostring Project. The Nanostring is a rapid diagnosis uh, program that will be able to lead to greater uh, ease and speed of diagnosis of patients with infections of the cornea in order to be able to treat them before they cause scarring and blindness. So the key to saving vision uh, in corneal infections is rapid diagnostics. Uh, to know exactly what's causing the infection and what tools we have to manage that. A technology that we're uh, very excited about is called nanostring technology. And it's a, a DNA-based molecular diagnostic tool that doesn't require the bacteria to grow. It can detect, in principle, as little as one DNA molecule. Corneal ulceration is a disease that literally can affect anyone across any society. But it tends to have a worse impact on the poor. They have less access to care. It takes longer to get to someone who knows what to do and less access to medications. If we develop a thorough understanding of all the organisms and all the causes of corneal ulceration, that can lead to platform techniques, which uh, in some cases can be made very low cost. So nanostring, which is one of the first technologies that we're using, is not necessarily going to be low cost at first, but as technology advances, we may have simple in-office tests that could be done to look for the most common agents or agents in which there are really good therapies uh, that can be applied also at low cost. Another area that will be supported by the Tej Kohli Cornea Program at Mass Eye and Ear is the GelCore project. GelCore is an exciting new technology which can replace the cornea without the need for a corneal transplant. This will allow us to reach all kinds of patients around the world that are not going to be able to have a human transplanted tissue. GelCore can be administered to the eye topically by means of a dropper, and then upon exposure to light, the collagen can cross-link and it can firm up and we can actually tune up and manipulate the degree of firmness and other mechanical properties of gel core. One of the reasons that we want to pursue new technologies in corneal research is that there are limitations to corneal transplant surgery. It is certainly one of the, of the success stories in transplantation, but it is not something that can be applied to everyone who needs it around the world. We know that of the 25 plus million people who are blind from corneal scarring in one or both eyes, less than 5% today are able to get a corneal transplant. GelCore does not require all of the complex human resources and surgical and medical resources that are required for conventional treatments. Therefore, for example, if a person is injured and instead of requiring sutures, you could apply biomaterial, shine a light for a few minutes, and then over time have that biomaterial not only keep the cornea intact, but actually mesh with the cornea and integrate with the corneal tissue, you can imagine the very distinct and significant advantages over taking a big chunk of the cornea out, putting a corneal transplant, and then have that patient be potentially at risk of a rejection process for the rest of their lives. The partnership of Tej Kohli with our researchers here at Mass Eye and Ear is just a tremendous way to advance the field in ending corneal blindness. The Tej Kohli Cornea Program at Mass Ear is really dedicated to furthering these diagnostic tools and new treatments for patients, and the partnership with Tej Kohli will allow those to get to patients so much faster. The $2 million gift from Tej Kohli uh, will help us launch the nanostring diagnostic and make that a uh, practically useful tool for rapid diagnostics. This work requires human capital, it requires people to do the work and people with expertise. And this funding will allow us to support those people and to support the laboratory work that they're doing. The support that we will be getting from the Coley Foundation will really enable us to make a major leap forward in further developing and optimizing the gel core technology, which can really address the needs of, we think, potentially millions of people suffering from corneal blindness.